Hey guys, today I have a little tutorial video for you. Um, so I'm going to be explaining how you can stream your PS4 right to your computer. Um, so this is with no capture card and not plugging in your console to your computer. It's just strictly through your Wi-Fi and through using an app actually. It was very simple to do, um, I'm kind of upset that I didn't figure it out sooner. Um, but now I know and I feel like it'll be helpful for you guys because it's super easy and you don't have to spend money like on a capture card and stuff and you're not also streaming right through the console, which I don't really like to do. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you step-by-step step how to do it right from your computer and with OBS. All right, so I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how to stream your PS4 to your PC. So open a tab for Google and you're gonna search PlayStation Remote Play. So the link you're gonna wanna click is this one here. So right on the PlayStation website, it's at the Remote Play page. So right on here, it tells you a little bit about what it does. Right on the setup instructions part, right at number three, there is a download link. So you're gonna click that. Brings you to this page. So you could choose either Mac or Windows PC. Um, it's pretty cool that they have Mac here because a lot of things aren't supported on Mac. Um, I'm on PC right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and click this. Set it up under wherever you would like. All right, and then when it's done, just click here, yes, and then just the regular setup sec, uh, yeah, sections here, no one ever really reads those, <laughs> and install, perfect, so now that it's installed, open the remote play app, so now that you have this app open, you can see here it's asking you to connect a DualShock 4. Uh, but before that, we're going to play around here in the settings. So first, you're going to sign in. So I'm going to go ahead and swipe this over while I type in my info. So write your email. And then next, type your password. And confirm that you're not a robot, unless you are. And sign in. So if you wrote all that correctly, it'll bring you back here and show that you're now signed in. Um, here is the video quality. Uh, before it was just uh, low to high, so only 720. Um, I do have a PS4 Pro, so I am able to do 1080p. So I'll go ahead and do that. Um, it might even be better for me sometimes just to do 720, but I'm gonna go ahead for this purpose to show you 1080p frame rate. You could have standard or high. Um, I do have the PS4 Pro and some pretty good internet, so this should be okay for now. Um, so yeah, we'll press okay here and then we will plug in the controller. Perfect, and then you're gonna press the options button on your controller and it's going to connect. Um, you could either find your PS4 on its own or you could do it manually. So I'm just going to register manually. So on the PS4, you go settings, uh, remote play connection settings, and then add device, pretty simple. Then it gives you a code that you have to type in quickly. It gives you, I think, about three minutes to type it in. Perfect, so I type in my code and click register. And there we go. So everything is automatically connected, so now I plug in my wireless controller here and I will enter a game. So now as you can see I am playing directly from my PC. I'm just going to load Infamous to show you the quality here. Perfect. So when I'm making movements compared to my TV, it looks almost immediately right after. There is about maybe half a second of a delay, which isn't too bad. Oh! So yeah, that is what it looks like on here. And as for OBS, um, so all you would do is how you would stream for a PC game. So just go into your regular scene selection. So this is what um, mine normally looks like here. 
So you're going to use a window capture, not a game capture. So for window capture, you are going to set it for PS4 remote play. And then it'll look like that. <laughs> I am dying here. Anyway, yeah, so that is what it looks like. It does look pretty good still on the computer. Um, if you do just have a regular PS4, you would just do 720, which is still fine. But yeah, I'm not really going to play right now. <laughs> so there you have it. So that's how easy it is to stream your PS4 right to your PC. Um, so yeah, it's pretty much just an app, set it up, get it going with OBS, and then you're good to go. So the only thing extra I would really recommend is that you have a good enough internet to do that because nothing's connected, it's all through Wi-Fi. Um, other than that though, you should be good to go. So that's everything for this video. Um, I hope this helped you because it actually helped me a lot when I figured it out. All I would stream is right from my PC because I didn't really want to play on my consoles. But this really solves that problem because I could play my PS4 games right on my computer. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I guess that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave some comments, like the video if it helped you, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!